Hi everyone, today I will show you how to make this sweater. Uh, it's so simple and it has a color like that. I want to try this color with you and I think uh, it looks good. And I made it, uh, I made short sleeves and I started from here, go like that and make these two panels that make here and here and finish it. It's so simple, you can make it easily, maybe in two or three days, because I use a bigger yarn. My yarn is Lime Brand yarns, but this um, label is not true. Uh, I found this yarn, um, some discount market, uh, so, uh, I cannot give you uh, the information about this yarn. If you know this yarn, please leave the comments, okay? Because I know someone will ask this, but I don't know, so sorry for this. It's a size 4 yarn, uh, I think. Uh, I'm not sure about the measurements, but uh, I use uh, four and a half ball of yarn. Uh, that's a small size. For larger sizes, uh, six ball of yarn fairly enough. I think you can make a large size with six balls of yarn. And I use eight millimeter hook and L hook uh, for all of this. And I hope you like it. If you like, please don't forget the thumbs up. And if you are ready, please don't forget to subscribe. We can start now. I will start with a slip knot and make 60 chains. It's finished. You can start with an, any even number. Just measure these chains uh, or measure yourself around your chest uh, and uh, divide it to use these measurements half. Uh, you can start like that. Skip this first chain into the second chain, insert and pull up a loop into the next chain, insert, pull up a loop, yarn over and pull through from these three loops, then make a chain, into the next loop, insert, pull up a loop, into the next one, pull up a loop, I have three loops, Turn over and pull through, make a chain and keep going. One, two, close it with a chain. One, two and make a chain just keep making like that i see at the end of the row i almost complete the first row i made the last one and make a chain i have only one stitch left i will make a single crochet here chain one turn now you see here this space Insert your hook here, that's the first stitch, and insert your hook this side this time. Make a chain. Skip this. 
we will insert here and here separate it by this loop or maybe you can call it post it's not a post but one two make a chain one two make a chain if it's a little hard to see you for you I made a blanket with this stitch before you can see it from here right now you can look it too one two it's so simple and I like to make this stitch Keep going like that, see you at the end. I made the last one, make a chain, and into this last stitch I will make a single crochet. Chain one, turn. And I will repeat the same thing. Insert here. Make a chain, insert into the next Skip this, we will work here. Plop a loop, plop a loop, yarn over, pull through, make a chain. And we will just repeat this uh, for how many rows we want. Uh, again, you can measure yourself from, from uh, um, your hips and uh, your under and neck uh, you can find the measurements like that and I will make it when I turn back I will give you the measurements I made it a little longer uh, it's 21 inch long and 20 inch long you can make it bigger of course and now we will make the front part Starting from here, I will count two, four, six, eight, um, ten, twelve, fourteen, sixteen, eighteen, twenty, twenty two, twenty four, twenty six, twenty seven. Put a stitch marker here. Chain one and start to make our stitch. That's the last one. Chain one and make a single crochet into this last stitch. Chain one, turn and repeat the same thing we will keep making like that here make it same with here uh, you can count your uh, rows here uh, or you can just um, make the same measurements um, i have 60 rows and i will make here same i will make 60 rows totally then uh, we will make this part i will show you uh, it too if you are making a bigger size uh, you can make here longer uh, i will just skip a few stitches here i will make 27 here 27 here it's 54 i think and uh, I think I will left five stitches here. You can skip uh, seven, eight. It's not too important. Just a little, a little opening here. Okay. Um, I will make here and turn. I complete one side 
here. And I will make the other one right now. I will start from here because we, for this side, we start from here and uh, make the first row like that. So I will skip one, two, three, four, five into the sixth stitch, insert my hook and uh, I have 27 stitches here too. Make a chain, insert here and here. Make two single crochet together. Sorry, make a chain. Make one, make a chain, make one, and keep making. And for the last one, make a single crochet. Chain one, turn, starting from here. Repeat the same thing. Make two single crochet together, chain one. And make this side for 60 row again. Complete this row too and I'll see you. I complete both sides and I join this side. I will show you how to make it right now. That's the um, uh, back. Uh, wrong side of my work okay right side is inside looking to each other i will join it with a hook but if you want you can use a yarn needle put these two together insert from here grab the yarn make a chain Insert into the next space and insert here too. Grab the yarn, make a slip stitch. Insert into the next stitch. Um, there's not a stitch, of course. Uh, you can insert every uh, space you see. Insert here. I will insert all of um not all of of course i will insert this side like that i will just leave eight ins from here for the um, sleeve uh, you can make it longer if you want to make here wider i will uh, complete it and turn you see that's eight ins long right now cut the yarn make a chain and we can hide the tail turn the right side i made one of the sleeve and we can make the other one together insert from here i made the same thing for here too 
I insert from the back side and go like that. This time I will insert from here and go like that. Join. Insert into the first stitch, grab a yarn, insert into the next stitch, grab a yarn. Complete together, make a chain. Insert into the next rows, make one. See, I'm inserting into the uh, row and into the next row make one chain one here the important thing is here you will make same both sides i had totally 20 uh, sets of this uh, uh, how can i say it? cluster a little uh, single crochet clusters i have 20 of them and now I will make the same thing. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. And turn, keep going, see you here. I made nighting cluster and insert here, make a single crochet, join with a slip stitch. Chain one, turn. And starting from here, make the same thing again and again, make 19 cluster and a single crochet is totally 20 and make it for six rows always turn your work when you reach here make a single crochet here then join with a slip stitch and keep going like that make it for six rows then i'll see you that's the end of the sleeve i will insert from here uh, sorry it's not end yet I will make one row with single crochet and a seven millimeter crochet hook insert into the every stitch You don't have to insert into this stitch. Sorry, just a sec. You don't have to insert here. You can make it here too. Here. Is there's a problem? Uh, yeah. Okay, just put one single crochet for every single, every stitch, sorry, and complete the sleeve. I'm making the last one, join with a slip stitch from the first stitch, make a chain and cut the yarn. Hide this tail.
will make single crochets for here too. Okay, and I will just make single crochet for this part. Uh, then later we will make here too around the neck we will go like that first we will make um how could we call it please tell me okay uh, what you call here and this side please call me i will use my seven millimeter hook insert from here now I try to put uh, one single crochet for every stitch with 7mm but it looks bad to me so I try to make it like that this time I'm using 8mm hook insert from the first stitch chain 1 make a single crochet into same place then skip one stitch Insert into the next one and make a single. Skip one stitch, insert into the next, make a single. Skip one, insert into the make, uh, insert into the uh, next stitch and make a single crochet. Skip this one, make a single. Skip one, make a single. If you saw uh, this is too tight you can put a single crochet into the next stitch for once then put one more into the next then skip one into the next make one skip one into the next make one time to time you can put one more anywhere you want okay not one more you uh, will not skip a stitch you will put a, a single crochet for this one too and then put one then skip the next one again okay I think it, it looks better with this way you see it looks nice actually I don't need to put uh, one more here maybe I can fix it too and when you reach here keep going the same thing make one skip here make one skip here make one skip one skip and one and make single crochets like that when you complete the row reach here make a single crochet chain one turn back and put one single crochet into every stitch you have and keep going like that I'm not sure how many rows I will make right now I will make it turn back and tell you I made the single crochets for five rows and I will not cut my yarn I can make a chain and starting from here I will make single crochets again I will put one single crochet for one uh, row you see I'm making this side left side and for here uh, I will uh, uh, follow my sense actually you can put one single crochet into each row if you want you can use a smaller hook here maybe I can change my hook and use seven millimeter let me see i will make it a little more um, if it looks good i will keep going like that 
I think it's not too um, loosey. You can see like that. I will put one single crochet. into each row so keep going like that turn around here when you reach here you will have stitches you can make the same thing we did here you can put one here, skip one, put one here, skip one. Or if uh, that's the neck, uh, you can put a little more than there. You can put one uh, single crochet into each stitch and turn back, put one uh, single crochet into each row. And when you reach here, you can put one, two, three and four a single crochets chain one turn and make it again just uh, turn around the sides with single crochets for how many rows you want um, then I want to make a different neck this time I want to make a color I think it's color uh, I will make here turn back and uh, see you. I complete this sides too and I made totally um, seven rows for here and now we will make a, a color here I can give you the measurements. It's 15 centimeters, six uh, inches long. I put two um, stitch markers here. I think I can change this one. I can put it here. And that's better. And um, I will join from here and put a single crochet into the same place and um, keep uh, going put some single crochets uh, I'll see you here I reached the stitch marker put my last single crochet here I have 36 single crochets but it's not too important of course now into this first stitch I will put two single crochets then put one single crochet into each stitch I'll see it and again I made my single crochets and I have one stitch left here I will put two single crochets here chain one turn and into this first stitch put two single crochets again and put one single crochet into every stitch except the last one into the last one put two single crochets and keep going like that I don't know how many rows I will make it like that if I thought like I made so much increasing 
I could make it like that. Uh, make increasing for one row. For the next row, don't make any increase. And for the next row, make increasing. I could make it like that too. I will just try it. And when I turn back, uh, I will tell you uh, how I made it. Just wait for a second. Okay, I will turn back. To I complete the neck. And I made it as I told you. I made... Uh, the, uh, a row without increase and in the next row I made an increase uh, you can think it like that uh, I made an increase in every even row uh, row 1 without increase row 2 increase with increases row 4 with increases and like that I made totally 12 rows uh, I made increases here and here into this last row and now uh, I want to make a final touch I will make single crochets around this um, here and all of this uh, brim uh, I will start from here when I reach you can you know how to make here uh, I will see you there okay I will show you how to make here I made here now I will insert into this first row and make a single crochet and put one single crochet into uh, every row and for the corner you can put two single crochets if you want you can even put three And keep going make here I see it I, I see you there and for the corner I will put two single crochets again turn back and put one single crochet into every space you see and That's the last one, starting from the first empty stitch, make your single crochet to here and finish the cardigan. And it will look like that. As you see, I really like it very much. It's a kind of 19th style, I think. And uh, I will show you the back one more time. And I hope you like this tutorial. You can show your cardigans to me from Instagram. My Instagram address is Sirin's Crochet. And it's also my Pinterest and a website address too. And that's it for today. Hope to see you again. Have a nice day.